episode of the Anime Breakdown Show. I'm your host, DX Team 10 xv Today we're going to jump right into it. Uh, today is another great episode, the Naruto Breakdown, episode 279. Uh, this is the White Zetsu's Trap. Um, this is a decent show. I mean, uh, I think the next couple of these are going to be filler, but it's going to be filler-related material. So, it's nothing wrong with watching this. There's no reason for me to skip a review on this because... It's not just some random ass episode where they're just doing random stuff. So I will be uh, reviewing these, uh, as you can see, um, <laughs> and um, you know that that's just what it's gonna be. Um, at this point in time, um, this you got Hinata, you got Kiba, Akamaru, and Shino. Um, you know they're doing they're trying to go find out. How the Zetsu getting in there. When it starts off, you see um, Sakura pinned down on one of the white Zetsus, you know, kind of grinding them just a little bit, you know, trying to get the information out of them. Um, <laughs> and, um, you know, she's doing her thing uh, and transitions over over to that team. I forgot what it was, Team 7, Team 9, I don't know, it doesn't matter. Uh, you got, you know, transitions back over to Shino's team. They got to go find where the barrier is uh, letting the Zetsus in. They're going to this little cavern. Um, and come to find out, you got Zetsus everywhere. So they're being attacked. You got the ceiling team show up. Uh, an explosion happens. And everybody gets trapped in there. And then, you know, they have to figure out what, you know, remember the Zetsus make an exact replica of whoever they touch, no matter what it is. Um, and when they did that, all hell breaks loose when, you know, Shino has to become a detective and figure out, is it Hinata or Kiba? Now, this whole time, I'm thinking, I hope they don't do anything where, like, uh, Shino's actually the one who was the Zetsu. Because we really didn't see, you know, everybody got separated at one point. Um, you know, but Shino was the only one who was able to use the bug technique. Uh, he used like the bug sphere or whatever to keep people at a distance. You know, Hinata and Kiba, you know, they, they do hand-to-hand -hand combat. You know, the, the what, fucking, what's her name? Hinata has to do gentle fist. So, you know, you have to make contact with the enemy. Um, and so does Kiba, especially with Tango and Fang and things of uh, that uh, kind of shit. But um, basically, the whole episode was just Shino just trying to figure out. Uh, who did it? Uh, it wasn't the world's greatest episode, but it was okay. Um, you know, you get to see them kind of, you know, it's kind of like guess who, like, you know, is it this person or that person? Um, basically, through a series of different questions in the game Rock, Paper, Scissors, um, he figures out that it's really Kiba he's working with, and then he immediately attacks Kiba. They start fighting. He uses a clone jutsu, of uh, insect, uh, and that later reveals Hinata, um, or Hinata, as the um, the white Zetsu. They come back, kick ass, take names. Uh, Hinata's rescued because she was actually knocked down somewhere. I, I don't know why she's always going down, but you know it's whatever. We still like her because you know what? All right, Naruto's gonna get fucking mad. Um, you know, things transition. Whatever, 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 yada, yada, yada. Um, you know, that was pretty much it. It really wasn't that much in this episode. I think the next episode is going to be more filler stuff, but I think it's going to be better. I think we're going to see some things that's going to be a lot better in uh, episode 280 of the filler. So, you know, like I said, as long as it stays war-related, it's always going to keep me engaged. It's always going to keep me focused. Let me know these kind of fillers keep you engaged, keep you focused, because technically they are staying on track. It is nice to see what's going on in different parts uh, of the war. What is everybody else doing? What skill sets do they have? Uh, I don't know if that other one is going to be focused. I can't. I can't remember the the mangas. You know, sometimes they kind of put fillers. I don't know if they put fillers in the mangas. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. It's not. It's not on Naruto getting to the war. It's not um, the Kage's having to stop. We got Lady Tsunade and um, uh, the Rock Kage. Who's supposed to stop Naruto and Killer B? So we're not there yet. Um, remember, at one point in time, we saw uh, what Sh Shikamaru's dad. He was under a lot of uh, pressure to figure out 
how to stop these white vessels. We didn't get back to that point either. So, like I said, I'm assuming that these are fillings uh, because they're not main topic events. Uh, so, we're going to enjoy for what it's worth. We're going to see a little bit of the data, see some of the uh, samurai, you know, bust out their swords. We're going to see what they can do. So, I'm excited. I, lo I love seeing the Naruto shows. I'm not complaining. I don't want it to end too fast because when the mangas, we feel like we're getting to the end. Um, so, I'm, I'm just happy to see that it's prolonged. That they're, they're taking their time and I get to enjoy it for a few more months. Uh, as always, you guys do, you, do what you do best. Rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, you know, let me know what you guys think about these fillers. Let me know what you guys think about the show. Um, you know, for people who have been jumping on board, uh, you know, appreciate you. Uh, I just moved to my new place, so hence the new background. Hence the, I haven't put my picture up, but I got my man in the back, Bruce Lee. Uh, if you want to know how I got into anime, that's that's it. That's the, that's the answer. Before anime, I was watching Kung Fu films. Yeah, there's not much to say there. Uh, <laughs> I was watching Kung Fu flicks, and when you're young and then you see Kung Fu mixed with animation, it was like, wow, just blew me away. Just blew me away. Tell me the reason why you got into anime. Uh, what was the catalyst before you start watching anime? Uh, was it just because it was a cartoon, or was it because you had some related interest within it? My related interest is that guy in the back. I mean, I, I mean, I love Bruce Lee. I love Chinese Connection. I love the Legend of Bruce Lee, Fist of, uh, Fist of Fury. I mean, I, I love his old shit. I got all his movies. Um, I download them. I rewatch them. I watch the biographies about him. Uh, I've seen the biography movie about him. I mean, you know, that's that's my dog. That's my dog. Hence, I got a picture. So, you know, hope you guys enjoy everything that's going to be coming out. They're going to be coming out on a regular basis. They're not going to have to worry about somebody walking in. I'm in, I'm in my man cave. I'm gonna, once I get it set up, I'll give you guys a little tour. Um, but other than that, do your thing below. Rate, comment, subscribe, and peace.